Hello there, my name's James. I work for Winchester Caravans. Um, let's just take you on a little walk around this Pegasus 514. So let's check out the outside. This is a 2010 Bailey Pegasus 514. It's built using Bailey's patented Alliotech construction. The front of the van, we have your gas locker, three front windows, and then you have storage on both the near side and the off side via the side lockers. Back in the day, the Pegasus was the top of the Bailey range. So you have the nice little touches, such as the external gas point, as you can see there. Further along the van, we have the external electric point, just under the battery box. And this one is also fitted with the alloy wheels. This caravan has an empty weight of just 1250 and all up of 1466. So it can be towed by most standard family cars. Let's take a look around the offside. We'll just take a look at the offside of the caravan so you can see there's no major knocks or bumps. It's actually in generally very good condition. It does need a good clean externally and internally. And it obviously receives that prior to collection from yourselves. On this side, we have wet lockers, number one and two. We have your water inlets and the gas flue for the hot water system, just in there. And then entrance to the cassette toilet with the flush at the back of the van. Let's take a go inside and take a look at this Bailey Pegasus 514. So as we step in the 514, we're met by the side donut table right in front of us. And as I turn to my left, you can see we have the nice big living area at the front of the van. So bed wise, this living area will turn into a huge king size double or obviously it could be used as two singles by removing the backrests. The side dinette makes up into two bunk beds, number one, and then you can just see that that will make up into a second bunk up in behind. So I'm now facing the back of the caravan and I have the kitchen on my right. You will notice we actually do need to replace a catch on the oven down there. But as I said to you in the email, this would be done prior to collection. Heating in this caravan is via the Truma heater there. This will run off gas and electric and you have a blown air system. Blown air will take 80% of the heat from the heater and circulate it around the caravan. Again, the hot water is Truma. This would also work via gas and electric giving you the benefits of being able to use the caravan on both electric or via the gas if you're not plugged in to the 230. Extra little bits, bits and pieces of specification include the Omnivent. This is a two-way fan, which can be used to either extract air or bring air in to the van on a nice warm day. You've got the 230 volt microwave and let's just show you on all the windows, they do come with the blackout blinds and the fly screens. Let's take a look into the washroom. So as we head on into the washroom, down to my left, you can see we have the Thetford cassette toilet, electric flush. We have the huge shower so the nice fully sealed shower, which also has the step out area and just tucked in behind here, we have the heated towel rail. Just in front of me, we have the vanity sink, mirror, and then off to my left, another huge, great big wardrobe. 
with both hanging space and space down the right for your folded bits and pieces. So we'll just spin back round into the main body of the caravan. A little recap. As you can see, you have storage all the way around the top of the van in this van. Underneath, we have a full 12 volt lighting system, which is all LED. Large front double, side dinette, which converts into the bunk bed. And then the kitchen with Dometic three-way fridge. We have the sink, so it's got the cover on at the moment. The full gas oven, separate grill, and four burner hob. At some point in this life, the previous owners did fit another piece of laminate onto the worktop, which you can just see there. It is fitted so it isn't coming off. It actually matches quite nicely and gives you an area to take your pans off the hob when you're actually doing a little bit of cooking. As we've said in the email, this caravan has been reduced from 9995 down to the 8995. If it was for you, we'd be happy to offer it to you for 8,500. That includes the warranty and all the pre-delivery inspection checks and putting right any bits and pieces on the caravan which needs to be. Have a look and come back to us.